welcome, welcome. Come in. This is where it all goes down, in here. Where is he? Oh! Oh! <laughs> yes! So that's the office. Uh, super easy to concentrate and just like work on graphics all day. Okay. This is our first office right here. We originally came up with uh, a lot of the ideas, like the drawing board right here. Start off, this is the uh, athlete lounge. Uh, you know, we keep them uh, fresh to get out before they go on the streets. They like to warm up in here. This is Hayden. <laughs> Say hi, Hayden. Hey guys. This is uh, the office dog, Clive. Hey, bud. There he is. All right, ready? Wait. Check it. So, yeah, we're pretty proud of that. And it's heat, so it's not using ink. That's the crazy part. It's thermal. That's what I'm told. No ink. Uh, this is our inspiration wall. We kind of look at that whenever we have um, questions about why we're here and what we're doing. We do not applaud fraud. We do not applaud fraud. When they ask you net 30, what do you say? Net now. Net now. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, super positive. Uh, Working environment, I do that every day. It's about time for your neck massage too, Scott. What is that thing? Oh, don't, he, it's a game we play where they act like I don't do this every day. Super funny guys. Uh, we've been here for a year now. And before that, we were in Taylor's room. I paid a little bit of his rent and he slept among boxes. And then before that, we were on my kitchen floor. And before that, we're in the van. I don't know, Johan was just annoying me to film him one weekend. Come on, baby, let's make a weekend Taj. Come on, come on, come on, let's film a weekend Taj. Let's film a weekend Taj. Because he was visiting me in college in Orlando for the weekend, so weekend Taj, and it just kind of went from there. Right here, dude, film it. What you got? Boneless. First try? Uh huh. There's like a gnarly nail over here though, man. It's fine, I'll watch out, I got it. You sure? Alright. Alright. Dude, I almost did that one. Oh my god, dude, you got a fucking nail on your head, man! How bad is it? It's really fucking bad! Ah! You're in the hospital! Here is uh, more inspiration, is old VHS tapes. We watch uh, a lot. And it seems like there was a lot more humor in skating back then. And stuff was pretty funny. Destroying America kind of gets us inspired to film some funny stuff and mix it with skating. Maybe we do it too much, I'm not sure.
where we come up with most of the ideas, I think, when we're out skating. Kind of just throw an idea out and then it goes around the van and then goes into a computer and then changes a little bit and then goes into a group text and then it gets torn apart there, goes back to the computer, then a skateboard comes out. So that's kind of the process we've been running. Recently just put Austin Gillette on, so he skates for us, which means he's part of the shipping program, creative team. Yeah, once you get on, you get a chore list. You're not just skating for us, you're working for us. We've got nine dudes on the team, and we're all really close friends. No one got on through sponsor me tape or anything. Um, it's just it's through hanging out, and you know, it just fits perfectly. We have a lot of personality, a lot of different personalities, um, you know, it's just with, with skateboarding and everything that goes into it and, and, and just, I just wanted to have my footprint in it, you know, with my friends and, and, and that's what this brand is about. <laughs> is that pretty sad? Ooh, where do I want to see the brand in five years? Such a hard question because we're still trying to figure out next month. I want to get on more of a calendar and where we're ahead on the calendar. It's so tough though. Especially with everyone working other jobs, but we're working to get uh, more ahead on that calendar. If we can make it successful enough so my friends only have to have one other job instead of two, that would be pretty cool. Mm -hmm. 